Well, I mean, you, you're here for a purpose at the end of the day. You know, God created you. Um, I mean, he, he, we had, you have a creator. Um, and at the end of the day, there's two things, life and death. And the fact that you're alive, that means you're living. But it's something that even if you're a non-believer, it's something you have to face with the real, realization there comes a death. And that's a price to be paid for that. And, um, and Christ has already paid that price for you. At the end of the day, you can either accept that or reject that. And the word of God, which we believe is the truth of God, tells us that there's only one way to heaven. That's uh, John 14, 6 says, Jesus said, I'm the way, truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father except through me. And at the end of the day, there's a man. God came in the form of a man to take that place for you. You know, and so you can either accept that or reject that at the end of the day. And that's, that's the truth we stand on. And, um, you know, Christ is, is truth. He is the way and the life. And um, you can either accept, like I said, we all have, have a testimony. But at the end of the day, you can, you can live on purpose or you can live and die without fulfilling the thing that God put in you is to live a life and that's to live for him and give him glory. So that's the truth we stand on. Um, I truly believe that we all have an opportunity to accept him. But at the same time, you have to make a choice. And then David wants you to choose Christ and, um, and so you can receive that salvation through him.